What's up everyone, welcome to this new video. So today I will be comparing these two batteries, the Dynamo Alkaline battery and the normal battery that is not heavy duty. Of course the Dynamo Alkaline battery like this should be heavy duty. I cannot show you the brand of it. And uh, I tried to do the experiment with this battery but unfortunately I did short circuit it by accident so I took it out and took a new one. Now the circuit in front of you is for switching the voltmeter from one battery to another. Here I will turn it on to see how it works. Now the LED is lighting here on this battery, which means that uh, the voltmeter is should measure the voltage of this battery. I will connect it to here like this. And now the voltmeter is measuring the voltage of this battery because the light is lighting to here. And now the relay will switch the voltmeter to the other battery. And the LED will light on this one. As you can see, it switched and the uh, other battery has a higher voltage. Now, I didn't use the batteries at all. I just used them to measure the voltage of them because the voltmeter will drain some voltage. This is all what I used the batteries for the berries are still new so uh, now I have here a stopwatch that will uh, see the time until when the berries will give power before they are dead I have here a 1.5 ohm load which should be 1 amps and uh, 1.5 watts uh, the berries are gonna give 1.5 watts uh, until they are dead and I will see for what time they will give power I think now batteries are dead. I don't know, maybe if I shake them. Yeah, I got some voltage, so they are dead. This is the end. Okay, so let's see the results. So, as you can see, the results are very close to each other. But if you watch the video, you can see how the Dynamo Alkaline battery did die before the other battery which means Dynamo Alkaline batteries are not really efficient and better than any other battery in the market. You can just save your money by buying non-heavy duty batteries and you get the same results.